after it has arrived on site, the machine should, if possible, be stabled in a straight section of track in order to get it ready to start work. The handover operation is done with the key switch on the driver's control desk turned off. When the handover operation is completed, the direct brake is active and the machine is held stationary. The direct brake is put into the retaining position, but the indirect brake can then be released with the FB11 and remains in the filling position. A check must be made of the brake pressure gauges of both brake circuits to see whether the machine is braked. When the machine is safely braked, a start can be made on releasing the transport safety chains.